The largest auto market in the world, China, has achieved a significant milestone in the electric vehicle industry by having EV sales surpass 50% of total sales. Whoa! Hi, my electrifying pals! We would like to share some exciting news with you all today. It's a huge victory for China's electric car market and encouraging news for the world's electrification objectives. We'll go further into this milestone and consider the ramifications of such a significant change in car sales in this video. So grab a seat and let me take you on this thrilling adventure. Come on, let's go. In a recent interview, Wang Shanfu, the chief executive officer of BYD, made a bold forecast that within the next three months, electric cars would account for more than 50% of the market for automobiles in China. In contrast to the Chinese government's estimate that it will occur in 2025 or 2026, analysts have expressed their disagreement, arguing that it is highly improbable that it will occur until the year 2028. Despite the fact that Fu's prognosis was not challenged in any way, it cannot be denied that it was cautiously optimistic. It is evident, despite this, that the chief executive officer of BYD possesses a deep understanding of the electric vehicle business. It is clear from this forecast that electric vehicles are becoming increasingly popular, not only in China, but also around the world. There is a lot of excitement surrounding the electric car market right now, and everyone anticipates that there will be even more remarkable advancements in the years to come. The government's initiatives to support green energy can be blamed for this increase in sales. The Chinese government has imposed a number of regulations, including tax incentives, subsidies, and bans on the sale of gasoline and diesel vehicles, in an effort to encourage the use of electric vehicles. In addition, the government has set high standards to lower air pollution and the nation's carbon footprint. China intends to phase out gasoline and diesel cars in the near future and wants to have 5 million electric vehicles on the road by 2020. Sales of electric vehicles have increased as a result of industry innovation and increased competition. While multinational automakers like Tesla are expanding their production capacity in China, domestic manufacturers like BYD and BIC are offering more reasonably priced electric vehicles. Customers are starting to accept electric vehicles as a competitive alternative to conventional automobiles since they offer more alternatives and are less expensive. Even if the trend is encouraging right now, issues still need to be resolved before EVs are widely used in China. These include certain electric vehicles' short range and the absence of infrastructure for recharge. Together, the government and automakers can overcome these problems and encourage China's transition to electric vehicles. This result signifies a huge step forward for China's sustainable transport aspirations. The country is heavily pushing the development and deployment of EVs, which are considered as a key component of its efforts to decrease carbon emissions and combat air pollution. The development in EV sales has been driven by a combination of causes, including government subsidies, automakers extending their EV choices, and rising public awareness of the environmental benefits of electric vehicles. The BYD CEO's prediction has proven to be true, illustrating the increasing accuracy of future projections backed by machine learning and artificial intelligence. As we continue to harness the promise of these technologies, we can expect to see increasingly accurate data-driven insights that generate beneficial social and environmental change. According to data from the Chinese Passenger Car Association, retail sales of passenger automobiles in China have fallen year over year to 56,000 units. The overall car sales in China have declined by 11% in a short space of time. However, electric vehicles, EVs, have enjoyed a substantial 32% yearly growth, helping them take the bulk of the market at 50.4%. This growth in market share is an outstanding success for EVs and puts Europe and America to shame since their EV sales have slowed down and even dropped in some locations. EV sales in the US have experienced only a minor gain of a few percent in the first quarter of this year. However, this little rise is from a low base of barely 9%. Meanwhile, last year, Europe suffered a decrease in its EV sales due to the expiration of incentives. On the other side, China continues to stimulate EV development since it aims for cleaner air in its cities and expanded EV production by domestic vehicle makers. As a result, EVs have achieved more market share in China than any other country, currently standing at 50.4%, while Europe and America lag behind. The Economist Intelligence Unit expects that NEVs should account for more than half of China's sales by 2028. Meanwhile, Chinese Federation of Passenger Cars produced a research claiming that NEVs will make up 40% of sales this year, but BYD's CEO expects that the figure would be 50%. The ongoing incentives and resulting increase in demand for EVs indicate that the Chinese government's policy is working, and China could lead the way in the global EV industry in the future years. It appears that China alone is expected to see new energy vehicles, NEVs, reach sales of approximately 12 to 13 million this year. 
This includes a projected 7 to 8 million sales of completely electric automobiles, which would account for 10% of the global car industry. This means that global pure electric car penetration will top 10% this year, even without taking into consideration the countless EVs that will be sold in other nations such as Europe, the US, and Malaysia, among others. As such, it's projected that between 15 and 20% of all vehicles sold worldwide will be entirely electric in 2021. These data may span only two weeks, but are indicative of the trend that is ongoing. In the previous month, EV market share had reached 48%, with occasional weeks recording 40%. However, in recent times, this figure has climbed to an amazing 50.4%. The wholesale sales rates also confirm this trend, with a penetration sale of 50.2% during the same period leading to wholesale sales of 534,906. It's evident that the shift towards EVs shows no indications of slowing down with China now spearheading this revolution. The worlds of internal combustion manufacturers, notably legacy automakers such as Toyota, Honda, and Nissan, have sustained severe losses in China. As proven by the bankruptcy of Mitsubishi and Jeep in China, joining other EV manufacturers who are no longer active due to insolvency. Additionally, countless dealerships have filed for bankruptcy over the past 12 to 18 months. Even the likes of General Motors and Ford have witnessed a substantial reduction in sales in China. Nonetheless, there is a silver lining. A increasing number of consumers are intensely interested in purchasing high-quality EVs, spurring continual innovation in this field. This is exemplified by the development of new products like the Shenxing battery from Cattle, which is a lithium phosphate battery capable of charging at 550 kilowatt speeds, and novel innovations like BYD's Blade Battery 5.2, which can charge faster, boasts 27% higher energy density, and is cheaper than the original Blade battery that was launched a year ago. This upswing in EV usage is driving on a more imaginative and creative industry for EV-related products and technologies. Electric vehicles are on the rise, with a projected 27% improvement in energy density, 30% reduced cost, and faster charging capabilities compared to traditional internal combustion cars. This is the future of the automotive industry, as indicated by the drop in sales of major automakers like as GM, Honda, Volkswagen, Nissan, Toyota Camry, Volkswagen Levita, and Nissan Silphy. Sales for these brands have declined dramatically, suggesting the rise of electric cars as the main means of transportation in China. As internal combustion vehicles continue to lose favor, it is encouraging to observe the shift towards cleaner and more sustainable ways of transportation. One notable good trend worth mentioning is the improvements in air quality in China's cities, particularly Beijing. While not many Chinese people may be viewing this, for individuals who reside in China and have no option but to work in cities with terrible pollution, this is a critical development. Electric automobiles are the key cause behind the improvement of air quality that is equivalent to California. Breathing clean air is a basic necessity, and the adoption of eco-friendly automobiles is making a big difference in people's lives. Despite having little control over the air they breathe, this development has brought a great relief to the citizens. Undoubtedly, this is a huge step towards making the world an environmentally friendly place to live. Thanks for sticking around till the very end of this exciting video. We hope you enjoyed learning about China's impressive EV sales and the impact it'll have on the world. As always, feel free to leave any comments or questions down below and make sure to hit that like and subscribe button for more fascinating content.